Hello guys, Saprin here from FU for All. Uh, and this is a very short video, but this is an important update for those who are getting this error when they install the latest Salome Mecha 2021 version with uh, Singularity. So I just posted a video on my channel where I show you the whole process. But unfortunately, at the end, I'm still getting this kind of error coming out of my uh, Salome uh, terminal prompt. So uh, I finally was able to solve those problems. So I decided to make this very short video to show you how to solve this and where it's coming from. So first of all, you have to understand what, what this error message mean. So this GL invalid enum, etc. This is coming from OpenGL. And OpenGL uh, is using, you know, uh, the gra graphical hardware. So it needs GPU to work. And you see that it this error is coming from Mesa. So Mesa is a software used for software rendering when your GPU hardware is not available. So uh, what happened is that basically on my computer, I'm using Ubuntu. Um, I've been using it for a long time, but I've never thought uh, about setting up my uh, GPU card correctly because, you know, I'm not doing gaming on Linux. Uh, so, you know, what, what you can do to see if your graphic card is set up correctly, you go in Ubuntu help. Um, no, sorry, not help. Um, you go in um, about this computer, yeah. And now that I've installed it, I can see my uh, my graphical card, which is an NVIDIA GeForce GTX uh, 1060 mobile. So before I install it, it wasn't there. So I had two graphic cards on my computer, and you know it was using the other internal graphics, um, which is not good. Uh, so what happened is that. When, once I understood what was the problem, I found out how to install those drivers. So I, what I did is I went first to the NVIDIA website. I searched for which kind of driver were available for my car. So you have to find the version here. Um, and the, the one for my car was the 470. Make sure you find the right driver. So this is important. Uh, then I went into my terminal. I use this command sudo apt install nvidia driver 470, I install that. So it takes some time to download and to install. Um, and you'll have to uh, enter a secure boot password as well. Once you do that, you use this command sudo prime select nvidia to make sure that those drivers are selected. Then you reboot your computer. Um, and during the reboot process, you will have to um, you'll see a blue screen, so make sure you select the right options there. And by memory, you have to click on Enroll MDK. Then you'll have a Continue option and then click on Yes. Then enter your password, uh, the Secure Boot password, uh, and you should be okay to go. Uh, the only problem I had is that my keyboard is a French keyboard, so it's um, uh, I had to enter the password using the English QWERTY uh, password. So it's uh, it was a bit annoying, but I finally did it. Uh, once you reboot, your um, use this common NVIDIA SMI to make sure that your driver for NVIDIA card is installed. And if everything went OK, you should see here your driver and your card. After that, you can relaunch uh, Salome using um, you know the the comment that I showed in the previous video so which is um, so which is uh, this one Salome etc uh, and you don't need the soft because the soft is for software rendering it should write it's starting in GPU mode and once you do that um, you should be able to run this and uh, it will work very smoothly. Astor study launches perfectly. Uh, Paravis, um, all the other modules, everything should be smooth, and I have no uh, error message again. Um, well, I, I have not those error message. So it seems like that this new uh, Astor study is now using a full Python. Um, Python module, so you can run Astor Study with Python. So I haven't tried it yet, 
but this seems to be one of the innovation of this new uh, version. Okay, so that's all just for this uh, update video to show you how to install uh, the Salma Mecca. I hope it was useful. Thank you very much for watching.